Hey everyone, it is Mike the Dad Nerd here, and there are multiple reasons why you may want to move the installation of Call of Duty, maybe from one drive to another. Maybe you're running out of space and you need to move it to a bigger drive, or maybe you have a new SSD and the game is on a spinner and you want to move it to that new SSD. It's actually really simple to perform that move, and it does not require you to re-download the entire game, which can save you a lot of time. So in this video, we're going to walk through the quick, easy steps on how to move that installation, and let's start right now. All right, so if you launch the battle.net launcher, the Blizzard launcher, and you go to the game you want to move, so we're going to do Cold War here. If you click on Options and go to Game Settings, it will actually show you where the installation is. So right now it's on my E drive. If I actually just copy and paste that down below into, a, into the search box and hit Enter, it'll actually open that location for me. So here's where we are. So we're on the E drive. Now let's say we want to move this to a different drive. We're actually going to open up the new location here. So over here, this is my two terabyte drive. Let's pretend I'm running out of space and I need to move it, move it over. All we do is simply drag the folder. So we popped out a folder. We're going to move this folder and we're going to drag and copy it. And it's going to start the copy. So we're going to let this finish copying. And then there's one final step to tell the uh, Blizzard updater, the Blizzard launcher, where we installed that file. So we'll let this copy real quick. So now you have waited the three days for your copy to move over. I mean, all joking aside, it does take a while to copy the files over. Hopefully not three days. It took my machine about 10 minutes to copy those files over. I'm copying to an old spinner though, so it took a little bit longer. But now we have the files in our desired location on the D drive, uh, which is at my two terabyte drive. So now all we do is go back to that setting page and we're going to say use a different folder. So when we say use a different folder, I'm going to go to my two terabyte drive, Call of Duty, and I'm going to click on this folder where it's installed, and I'm going to click Select Folder. Then we're going to click Done. Now there is going to be some initializing that's going to have to happen real quick. It should happen fairly fast, and there we go, it's complete. So now the game is going to be launched from the new location. I would say do not delete it from the old location until you've confirmed that everything is done correctly. But now that it's all done correctly, you can go and delete it from the old drive, and you will be just fine, and your file is now moved over, and you can play the game from your new drive. I hope this helps you out. I hope the game runs smoothly for you, and it saves you from downloading a 100-plus gigabyte game for a second time. But until I see you guys next time, tech on.